Fort Carson soldiers hard at work cooking turkeys. They've been at it since Sunday because they have 3,000 to feed at the Salvation Army Community Thanksgiving meal. Bill Folsom got a look today at all the very large tasks. Soldiers here at Fort Carson are volunteering around the clock to make sure thousands of people in our community have a Thanksgiving meal. What they're doing inside the gates will be transferred for Thanksgiving Day distribution by the Salvation Army. Cook, carve, repeat. We did roughly about 300 turkeys. Fort Carson soldiers offer advice for anyone cooking for a crowd this Thanksgiving. Be patient. <laughs> Turkey takes a while. Be patient. The soldiers' cooking credibility is supported by the fact they've had three shifts cooking turkeys 24 hours a day since Monday at 12.01 a.m. So we're feeding 3,000. We're making 3,000 meals. They're preparing these meals for homeless people, for people just down on their luck where Thanksgiving meal would be too expensive for them. Soldiers volunteering their culinary skills to help the Salvation Army with its Thanksgiving community meal. We try to give back to the community as the community always gives to us. It makes me feel good to give back to the community. Planning started a couple months back. The days for cooking and carving require teamwork. Yeah, once you start going, you just come up with a system and we cycle throughout the soldiers. Each of us had our own role and it made everything easier. There are also side dishes that have to come together in the hours just before it's time to serve. Yeah, we're going to do all of it. The green beans, the stuffing, mashed potatoes, gravy. Their morale is pretty high, uh, given the fact that they're working, you know, around the clock and, and even on Thanksgiving, but uh, they, they're enjoying it and they're liking it. After days of a nonstop turkey task, you have to ask if these soldiers will be having turkey when they sit down for their own Thanksgiving meal. I don't think you can ever get tired of turkey. The soldiers are doing their part. The Salvation Army tells us they could use more volunteers from the community for their Thanksgiving distribution. At Fort Carson, Bill Folsom, News 5.